Hey guys, I just want to give you a quick demo of um, the Xero app. Um, I'm just going to show you what I mainly use it for, which is just for keeping track of receipts, uh, mainly for the credit card purchases. Um, so it's really good if you do purchase a lot of things on credit card and you just get receipts like this. Um, just to be able to pop them into zero straight away and then that way um, as soon as you've um, put them in the app you can take a photo of this and act, literally throw the receipt away um, you know rather than keeping a hold of all these receipts and passing them on to your bookkeeper or trying to enter them in later um, it's a really good habit to get into so I'll just um, show you how easy it is so using the zero app um, it's just a plain zero one and it looks looks something like this. If you can see that, that's the one um, you need to download because there's a couple, but that's the one you need. Alright, so I'll just show you. So we're in a demo company here um, and all you need to do, so if you've got zero yourself, this would be um, once you've logged in, your business would show up here. Um, and all you want to do uh, just to enter in the receipt is click this plus icon here and you want to go add receipt. So you just type in um, what it was for in the first column, which for this receipt it was milk. Where did you spend? It was purchased from Woolworths. Spent today. How did you pay? Um, if you've got a credit card here, it would be listed down the bottom. Um, but just for this example, we'll just say it's paid from a bank account. Categorise to account, um, milk is most likely to be staff amenities but as this is a demo company it's not in there so let's just pop it under general expenses. All right, that's all you need to worry about in that top section. We want to put the price which is $3.40. And milk doesn't include tax, so we just want to change this one to GST free expenses. All right, now attach files. We want to take photo. And all you have to do is take a photo like that. Click use photo. And that's attaching now. Once that's done, normally all you need to do is hit add. Um, if you've got multiple receipts or additional lines that you want to add. So if I had have purchased um, milk and something else like stationery, stationery would have GST and milk wouldn't. So we'd want to add an additional line um, split into items and quantities. And you would just add in another item, which would be stationery and you would add tax to that. So you just want to hit add and that's all you need. So once that feeds through to your credit card, which you should have active, um, it'll go green in zero and you can just click OK to reconcile. And yeah, you can throw out, throw out the receipt. So yeah, adding receipts in using the app is yeah, really simple and a really good habit to get into because um, these paper receipts you just, you can lose so easily. So.